Hey, Taz, looking a couple things of that reach across because it's number one, it's not always going to be there. If it is, I take it. I mean, it's, I think it's a cool, it transitions nicely. Yeah, it's a cool move. Um, but remember, number one, once I get here, the only re well, not the only, I could potentially put my hand behind the knee, even if they're not running away. But generally speaking, I'm, I'm putting my head there because they're running away. If they start running away and I don't put my head there, go forward. She's honestly, she's going to score on me. Try and score on me. She scores on me. If I don't put my head there, it's because I don't get the angle. If I change my knees, and she starts running, go. Here. I changed my knees and I loaded that foot up. I got the height again. All right. If the leg is straight and it's not bent, two things get you to unlock the knee. Head position and climbing up the leg. I need this hand, the hand that's on the ankle. I need this hand, the hand that's here on the ankle. See how it's locked out right here? I don't want to start reaching right here because the leg is blocking me right here. It's really blocking me. So I need to crash down, climb up. Now look at look at how all her look at the weight of her leg. Now I don't care if it's I don't care if it's straight because I'm above the knee right here. From here, block. Right, I've got the pressure. I'm driving forward still. My knee's gonna go right where her foot is. My head's gonna go down. And then I'm pulling this. Boom. Now I'm crowding. See how I ran my feet in. And from here. Try and cover. I mean, really, I've got a trap right here. All right. Any questions? It's a nice transition. All right. Um, if you can't, if you don't like this one, which is fine, <laughs> you can lace it. Here. I come underneath. All I'm going to do is grab the ankle, grab my own wrist. Well, I'm still gonna pull it, but now I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start. Um, I'm gonna start my roll, all right? So I've got my head in the right spot. I'm grabbing her, her ankle. I grab my own wrist. I'm pulling it through, and I'm arching, pushing that leg up. And go again. So every time I roll, I'm pushing her foot up. All right. Any questions there? Yeah, this is this is where I learned that that reach across from that lace. Eat the whole thing. I'm gonna show up from here. Actually, let's let's start from here. I want you guys to start from here. Here, if you don't like the pull through, block it. I'm above again. I'm above the knee with this hand. My armpit. Block it. Grab your own wrist. Block it. Grab it on the wrist. Pull it, and you're going to start rolling. Knee change. Arch, arch, arch. Push that leg up. See, I'm pushing the leg up. Try again. She doesn't like that. Look at look at where her legs are. They're crossed. They're like this. And if you're driving this up, she has no choice to go across her shoulder. See that? Any questions here? That that lace, grabbing your own wrist, it's a normal, that's one of the normal leg laces from a traditional position. And now we're transitioning to it. So think about it. I didn't even, did I finish the takedown? No, I didn't even finish the takedown. But guess what? I scored four points. I scored two. I scored it. They awarded me two points for a takedown, and they awarded me two points for the turn. So that's what's going to happen. Even though I didn't technically finish the takedown, I transitioned. So I've got four points. Transition to a takedown, two points turn. You potentially probably can roll her up two or three more times for the tech ball, right? Any questions here? All right. Let's start here again. She's running, she ran. I trapped the foot, right? 
So right now, this is the position. I'm climbing though. I don't let go of this one until I climb. Climb, and now I can start coming underneath, grabbing my own wrist, pulling it under. Bottom, you see how I hit my knee? Put my head on the ground. Right here. I'm gonna hit my knee, put my head on the ground. Grab my own wrist, pull it. I'm pulling it, and then I'm gonna push the foot up towards your chest, because I need to cross it, this leg in front of your thigh. Here. Right here. You see how I'm arching? I'm pushing this up. That probably does not feel comfortable for her right here. Drive through. There's two points. There's four points. Take down to a turn. And then I could probably keep going if that was in the way. But. All right. See that? Um, technically, technically, I feel like you know, the transitioning is no different than transitioning from a takedown to a tilt. Freestyle transition, it's the same thing. You just, you're thinking in a different way. So instead of a takedown to a, a tilt, you know, we're taking down to a lace. It's not, it's same same mentality. All right. Got it? All right, let's play around with that one and then we'll finish up with a little bit of live. Ready, one, two.